Hi guys, it's Andy from Nismo Tech UK. We're giving an overview for Sandberg. This is their brand new Play and Go headset. So looking at the front of the box, we've got the Sandberg logo right up at the top here. As you can see, the actual headset is on display. Moving down to the bottom, it mentions that it's easy to carry. We have a detachable cable, as well as a two-in-one -one cable solution to connect to your smartphones, to your PC, tablet, laptop, etc. The main idea for the actual headset itself is more of a sort of towards a gaming idea. Um, obviously, you are able to listen to music with it. Um, so, so really, it's sort of a, a bit of an all-rounder, really. So, um, up at the top, we've got a little bit exactly information, exactly the same information there, um, along with the Sunbird branding and again down there um, information on the back in multiple different languages and onto the specification we have a 1.5 meter cable along with a 3.5 mil mini jack um, and various other different connectors that we'll look at at the moment uh, the driver is a 14 millimeter driver on the earphones with a frequency response of 20 hertz all the way up to 20 kilohertz the microphone that's built in is an omnidirectional with a response of 30 hertz up to 20 kilohertz. And obviously, with all Sandbird products, it does come with a five year warranty. So let's now get into this and have a closer look at the actual headset itself. Just bear with me. So we've got these, uh, it's been sealed, and I haven't got any way of cutting it um, on me, so just bear with me move that okay if it will come out bear with me there we go so we'll move the outer plastic packaging to one side and remove the actual headset along with the various different types of cables which we'll look at in the moment so let's start with the actual headset itself it's, it's quite a small headset to be fair uh, we have got obviously some padding up at the top here that feels nice and soft um, onto the overall uh, sort of look at the headset I see it's predominantly black the version that we have here with a nice red band We've got the Sandberg logo here uh, with sort of nice chrome trim um, around the actual ear cup which looks quite nice um, there's no appears to be no indication Ah yes, here we go, just on the inside here, it does mention, I don't know if you can see that, that that's the left ear cup and that's the right ear cup. Um, it's got quite a nice um, sort of soft finish um, around the actual headband itself, which feels quite nice, a bit of a matte black look. Um, I see it's, as you can see, um, it's adjustable, which is good. Um, the ear cups themselves have quite a bit of movement not, not the most that I've actually seen um, and the actual design itself as you can see the actual ear cup sort of bend, bends down a little bit to one side on the I assume it's the left yet yeah, the left hand side ear cup we have got the uh, hole for the uh, cables to plug straight into the um, as you can see on the inside of the actual ear cups we've also got a little bit of foam to obviously protect the drivers in behind and we have got this sort of soft leather pad around the actual ear cups which aren't the biggest in the world um, but they I'm, I'm sure that they are quite comfortable which we'll have a look at in a moment so apart from that there's a hell of a lot of flexibility with the actual headband um, and the actual earphones themselves so um, oh here we go it actually folds up as well so that's a, a really nice added bonus and see how small that actually folds so um, that's really quite good quite impressed by that folds very easily um, and obviously you can do whatever side you wish and you can lay them down like that so yeah quite impressed with that so let's just look at the actual cables themselves so uh, just bear with me while I figure out how you actually get into all of this let's undo some cable ties and it looks like they've all been wrapped around each other so let's just try and get them out quickly uh, almost there uh, here we go so this is the first cable uh, quite long also we've got the 3.5mm uh, jack on that side um, we have got the inline remote here which is very small we have got a very small button on there uh, for us answering calls or for talking etc um, and by the looks of it that's the one that goes straight into the left ear cup like so once it's in um, you, you 
yeah, you've, you've got to pull on that quite hard in order for the actual cable to come out. So it's not got a locking mechanism, but at the same time, it's also relatively quite hard to pull that out. Um, relatively long distance from the actual headset itself to the actual microphone. So if you imagine, I'll see with that on your head, it's not going to be, um, it shouldn't be too much of an issue. So that then connects into this white adapter. And there we go. And I see then that extends it even further. And then you're able to connect that straight into your PC, obviously with the microphone and also the headset. It would have been nice to see this cable being in black to keep with the theme rather than a white cable um, or even red just to go with the uh, look of the actual headset. So what I'm going to do now guys, I'm going to connect this up to my music player and also up to the PC and give you my thoughts on the quality of the sound and also the microphone. Okay, so now on to my personal thoughts about the Sandberg Plug and Go headset. Obviously, I'm recording from the actual microphone itself to give you a bit of an indication as to the quality on the actual microphone. And at the moment, I am actually holding it um, probably about 30 centimeters around my mouth just so that it picks up the actual audio. I see it's an inline microphone, so if I leave it down to the one side like I've just done there, I don't quite know how, how well it's actually picking the sound um, up from the actual microphone. So it's just a bit of an indication there. With regards to the feel, the comfort, the build quality, exceptional. Don't expect anything less from Sandberg. It's very comfortable to actually use. The sound deadening on this is really good. The actual ear cups really engulf my, my ear. Um, it's a very comfortable feel, comfortable fit. The leatherette around the ear cups feels really good. Like I said, they are quite large ear cups on this. Um, the headband itself is very comfortable, very easy to use to put on, uh, very nice in the adjustments, etc. So overall, it's, it's a very, very good headset and something that I think you, you would potentially have to consider. It's only $21.99 from the Sandberg website. Obviously, we'll be leaving links down below. Um, but essentially, obviously, the, the main aim of this particular headset is to be used... Um, obviously with Skype, video conferencing, that sort of thing, um, and obviously any sort of listening back to music or anything where you have to do uh, recording. I did listen to it on my MP3 player. Um, it's not the most amazing quality that I've, I've ever heard, but it's certainly suitable, um, and definitely for the, for the money, it's very, very good indeed. And obviously the option to have the inline microphone means that you can take and receive calls from your phone very easily. So we hope you like the... Uh, so we hope you like the unboxing and overview for the Sandberg Plug and Go headset and we look forward to seeing you in our next video. We hope you liked our video review. If you did, then please leave a like as well as any comments or questions you may have down below. Full details and specifications on this item can be found at our website nismotech.com along with all the links for purchasing if you wish. Also on our site you'll find our latest reviews and current giveaways plus a lot more. We look forward to seeing you in our next review.